curious. What is it? I've been looking at these seal quarters. I think I've been combining them, or trying to combine them incorrectly. There are these tiny little grooves, barely noticeable to the human eye, but I think they slot together like... Yes, like that. You've done it, Piotra. You made quarter half. How you do? They just click together. It, it's like they were... Well, they were made to be like this, but... It's so simple when you realize it. And one more. There we go. The Hierophant seal is completed. And we shouldn't stay here. No, we should go back. Go back and place that seal in the temple. Indeed. Let's go do that and then return here. Hey folks, it's Kikoskia here, and welcome back to Let's Play Ravenloft Stone Prophet. And wait, last we left off, I figured out how to combine the pieces together. Yep, that was silly of me to not think about doing it that way. But then again, most things have been combined by putting them in your hands and then doing that. But, but not that thing. That thing wasn't. Also, those seem to be... Uh, yeah, those are probably the things that uh, we're going to be getting later. Also, there is a bird here. Let us kill the bird. The bird is gone. Alright, south we go. And we'll put the seal where it's meant to be. I hope Hydrophant does not wake up. For if they do, they may seek vengeance upon us. Or maybe they'll see that we placed this here and we're on their side. Are we on their side? Well, we're on the side of the people of Muha. Right, let's... There we go! We've done it! So now... We can leave and head... Oh, why am I going this way when we can just do this? But we have done a thing. I don't think we can do anything with that yet, because the prophecy, I have reread it, did say that we need to assemble both of them. Also, while we're here, let us assemble this now to make the three quarters complete seal. That saves us even more inventory space. Now we're back, we can keep exploring, and I'm actually going to uh, mark that there are stairs over here. I need to mark exactly where the stairs are. They are here. So let us put here that there are stairs up. There we go. Now I won't lose them, like I lost that teleporter in the Temple of Ra. I should really be doing that more often. Really be doing that more often. Anyway, we're going to go this way and find a potion we do not want. Well, I suppose we can take them for now. We do have a lot more inventory space now. We just gained six spaces. More golems? A pressure plate that will probably open the way forward. This appears to be a place for pressure plates. Not hidden walls. Yep, there's another one. And up here we have a wand of magic missiles. I mean, I suppose. I suppose that's useful. We haven't had any. Ah! I was about to say we haven't had anything happen, and then we press that. I don't know what any of this has done, though. Has it done anything? Not sure this do thing. Make nice noise, though. Hmm. No, not do thing. Perhaps there's one we're missing. Maybe. Or maybe it does something somewhere else. That could also be true. There's also one there that I might not have pressed. Just press every single pressure plate, Kiko. You'll find them. Or we'll have to go upstairs and find stuff there. That's also quite likely. Let's go back over here and double check there's not a pressure plate in this corner. Which there was, but I'm going to uh, press it again if I haven't already. And then we will head back here... And go into this corner where there is a pressure plate. 
Okay. And then we'll head upstairs. No idea what any of these are doing, but, uh... Oh! On there, too. This is when I have to press them in a particular order. Either way, upwards. And immediately a golem. Probably two golems, if I were to guess. One there, and... No, just one. Alright. Ah. A locked door. Let me get to that. Not sure if we're meant to be here right now. Well, of course we're not meant to be here. This is going to one's resting place, but... Still. Yeah, I feel like we should have grabbed a key earlier. But either way... They probably hit, uh... With great accuracy. Our armor class is the only thing that's keeping us alive right now. There are a lot of items on the floor. Potions... And other stuff that... Were probably left by previous would-be... Thieves. We are no thief, but we will be taking everything that we can that's useful. That was only five damage. And that was a trap there. Oh, there are a lot of... There are a lot of golems here! This is like, hey, I hope you like golems! I hope you have a melee combatant that can take these enemies out up close. I mean, backstab would also work. Could, like, turn invisible and backstab them for a colossal amount of da- Ooh. Well. Look at all of this. It looks very powerful. It also looks exactly like... It's actually worse than... Ah, it's actually worse. Oh, it's much worse. Oh my, it's much worse than what we were previously wearing. But, than what we're wearing right now. But, you know, we'll take the box. We'll absolutely take the box. The box is very useful. All right, um, what else could we put in here? We could put a few potions in here, I suppose. Uh, that there, that there, and... I suppose you can keep that. It seems very light. How, how light's that? Weight two? F nah, it's actually not that light. I was like, it's a light thing. No, it, it, it's really not. It's very heavy. But we're taking it. Could be worth something if we get out of here. Alive. Yes. Think less about lo yes, less about looting and more about survival. I know. Oh, lightning! There it is. Hello, golem! And that is... A shield? Is that a shield? A Harakiri shield. Well... This is a powerful thing. Yes, it's a very powerful thing. I can feel the magic radiating off it. Let me find out exactly how powerful. It is a Harakiri shield plus three. That increases your armor class to minus seven. And that is very impressive. What's not very impressive is how I keep getting hit by those lightning bolts. More golems? No? We appear to have reached a dead end. A falcon of great grace and beauty. It might almost have a personality of its own, as if the artist were depicting one creature in particular, and not world birds in general. Hmm. Maybe this is where we use that whistle. Maybe. It's worth a try. And a fine key, valuable in its own right. Let me give that whistle a go. That did not do what I thought it would do. No, it did not. Are we missing something? We might very well be missing something. I think what I'm doing wrong is that I've not used this enough times. Alright, that's once. There we go! The images come alive! How beautiful! If I'm not mistaken, 
Yes, a falcon, often prized as trained hunters, the companions of brave men. <whistles> By the gods, it speaks, yet it is no language I understand. How wondrous! <whistles> okay, we need to have, uh... Speak with animals prepared, so let us get the, uh, spell ready. We need to pray, uh, speak with, no, it's, uh, let's see, it's not there. Is it a memorized spell? I'm looking for speak with animals here. I I'm just completely blanked on it. Um, there it is. <laughs> there it is. I actually already have it. Whoops. I already have it prepared. Speak with animals. There we go. Now we can understand it. So we do this once. Sorry about it being quite shrill, but there's not much I could do here. Twice. And thrice. Here we go. The call. The call. The whistle sounds and I awake. Where? Where are you, my master? From where have you called? We have called you, beautiful one. The golden whistle is in our possession. You are not my master, no. The whistle you have, my heart is my own. Oh, my master, how I have waited for your call. Oh, my master, do you honor still the old vow? The old vow? What mission of honor does your master follow? As I am a bird of war, so my master followed the ways of battle so long ago. He was a hero, my master, a true warrior. When they spoke of the greatest soldier in all the land, it was of him they spoke. In time, the Pharaoh rewarded him. My master joined the royal guard and swore to protect the Pharaoh with his life. And yet, yet he failed. Ah, he was the one. Ah, to guard Angtapot. Did he die in the service of Angtapot? No, my master suffered not a single wound. The great priest of Ra, the Hierophant, made his way past my master with the stealth of a shadow. With the silence of night, the Hierophant stepped within the royal chambers. Anktapat met his fate at the fall of the Hierophant's blade. Your master must have felt great shame at his failure to protect Anktapat. Shame? Great shame. Yet my master swore that if he could not guard Anktapat in life, he would do so in death. He sacrificed his heart the vessel of his spirit and soul cast it into the desert. Forever now, my master guards the way to Anktapat's burial chamber. He is but a stony shadow of himself, as was I. None shall pass that way, now or ever, until the heart of my master is once again returned to him. We have read some of the history of which you speak. Can nothing beyond the heart of your master open the door he guards? No. Only my master's heart shall free him from the oath he swore. Only its return can release him from service to this evil lord. Once the heart rests again within him, he shall be free. Free to pass beyond the gate of the dead, and me with him. You said your master's heart was cast into the desert. In such heat and wind-blown sand, how might it be found? It would take the eyes of... of... Yes, it would take the eyes of a hawk or a falcon. Thank you for freeing me from the stone, my friend. Now I might soar again, feel the heat of the desert beneath my wings turn high in rising air. I shall climb above the yellow sands where nothing can escape my sight. Somewhere among the lizards, among the insects, among the turning tides of sand, I shall find it. If you return with your master's heart, beautiful one, how will you restore it to him? I depend on you. 
Having freed me from the stone, having heard the tale of my faithful master, you will help. I know you will. Place the heart in that space from which it has been torn. Free my master from his oath to Anctapont. Here we we have it. The heart of a hero. It's remarkably fleshy. Yes, it is. Glad I kept that whistle up until now. I'm glad you remembered that you had to use it three times. Truthfully, I didn't. I was just playing it idly. <laughs> then it was a happy coincidence. We have the hero's heart, which is good. Now... We need to make our way further in. And there has to be a way to open further progress. We just have to find it. We just have to figure out which of these pressure plates it is. Is it this one? One of these has to open the way forward, because this is literally the only place that we can do stuff now. There is nothing more that we can do. Like, anywhere. One of these must open something. I've missed a pressure plate somewhere. I must have. I must have missed one somewhere. One of these has to do it. And then Kiko spent the next 50 bajillion years pressing pressure plates, trying to find the one that opens the way forward. Because, oh my, have I not found the one that opens the way forward yet. I have not yet found it. I should just be... Press that. I must have pressed that one. I must have pressed all of these by now. I must have pressed them all. There's got to be something I've not done. That something has to be a pressure plate I've not pressed. Because everything here seems to open via pressure plates. Which is unfortunate because we have not found the one that is required. Unless I have to press them in a very specific order. Which could be true. I might have to press them in a very particular order to make things happen. Not the first time I've had that kind of puzzle in a D&D &D game. So let's go from... Hang on, we were told... We were told from west to east, weren't we? From west to east... So why don't we press them in the order of west to east? Because I don't think I pressed them in that order. I think I pressed them randomly. So up here, we have this one. And then this one. And then this one. Oh, please let this be it. Yes, it was! Okay! Kiko remembered the clue that he was given. Hooray! I 
heard something move. Me too. Was it what we needed? Yes, it was. Yes, it was. Ha <laughs> ha! We've opened the way forward. Good. Now we need to prepare for even worse things. That we do. That we do. And so, when we come back, folks, we have... ...opened the way to progress. And maybe the end of the game. Who can say? Who can say? It must be getting pretty close, considering that this is the Tomb of Anctopart. But there are many more ways we can still perish, including Anctopart. And so, I'll catch you next time, folks, and I'll see you then. Later.